I was especially grateful that he was able to reach out and touch so many people, so many lives, before he died. That is a great comfort to me. I can see that it would be. Um, speaking of his death, let me ask you, towards the end, just before he died, were there any signs of him being troubled? Troubled? Why would you ask that? Well, uh, I'm thinking of other young men that had meteoric rises to fame and who suffered untimely deaths. People like James Dean, uh, uh, John Lennon, Elvis, they all had a certain uh, aura that followed them of... Oh, yes, well, Joshua was troubled, but not in the rebellious or lawless sense. He was troubled by the fact that he couldn't do more. He used to say to me, Mama, there's so much to do and so little time. I didn't know then how prophetic his words were. Oh, hi. <laughs> Come and join us. This is Kathy of Joshua's widow. Uh, Kathy, this is Mr. Donna from uh, Inner Force magazine. How do you do? Sorry. I'm very sorry about your husband. Oh, thank you. Uh, Mrs. Clemens tells me that you and Joshua are planning on a national tour. I thought perhaps maybe well, you could Well, any plans us... that we had were obviously canceled oh, by his death. Of course. Um, Perhaps uh, you could uh, sit in on the interview. We're planning on making this a cover story. Well, I'm a little tired. Maybe some other time, okay? Well, I, I don't want to cause any trouble. Oh, look, just... we're, we're both tired. Uh, Mr. Donna, why don't I call you in the morning and we can finish the interview? Now, Kathy might, might feel a little more rested then. Uh, fine. Uh, we'll talk to you in the morning. Then. Yeah. Thank you very much. Sure. Bye-bye. Billy May, I don't want to have any part of this. Kathy, you have responsibilities. To whom? Well, to all of Joshua's fans. Look, they, they loved him, and they love you because you were married to him. You can't turn your back on them. I can't live in the past. I have a life of my own. Well, I know that. But I don't want people to forget Joshua. We mustn't let them forget. What's this? Oh, um, it's a, a new car I was looking at. Well, uh, isn't that a little flashy? Wow. I mean, you have an image to maintain. You are Mrs. Joshua Rush. I'm not Mrs. Joshua Rush anymore. You will always be Mrs. Joshua Rush. <laughs> 